This is the 2011-2017 Honda Odyssey. Before we get started, let me give a quick shout out to Mia Max Automotive for letting us use the car. They are a used car dealer here in Toronto. Check out the link in description for their entire inventory. Now let's go ahead and get started. Open the driver's side door. Right there by the driver's left side foot, that's the primary hood release lever. Pull it. Now in front of the vehicle, right on top of the Honda emblem there. One of the arms for the H like that. That's the secondary hood release lever. Push it right with one finger. When it's pushed right, raise the hood. Once the hood is raised, this requires a prop rod to stay in place. Get the prop rod out of place, put it in the hood in the slot with the arrow marking it. Just like that, the hood's gonna come down a little bit and now it's secured in place. That's good. Now that's the passenger side bulb right over there. In order to access it, we have to go from behind over there. Now there's enough space for me to put my hand and comfortably move the bulb holder around and get the bulb out. Now that black bulb holder over there with the electrical connector, that's the one. Okay, now pay attention to what I'm showing. The left picture is for the locked position, right is for unlocked. So what we're going to do is we're going to twist the bulb holder left just a little bit, like one eighth of a turn to go from locked to unlocked. That's the important part. Now I'm going to show you how it looks like when I'm doing it. This view is from the top, the camera's inside the hood. I'm going to put my hand and I'm going to take a few seconds and gradually twist it to the left. It's going to take a little bit of time because there's probably moisture so the bulb holder won't just easily come loose. But it's going to take a few seconds, twist it left just like that and now it's loose. There's another view from the top. Now the camera is looking in from the top, from outside. Now it's unlocked. Get the bulb holder out. And there it is. That's the bulb right there. Now it says it right there on the bulb. 3, 4, 5, 7, and 8. 3, 4, 5, 7, and 8. In order to get the bulb out, just simply pull it out. There are two filaments. One is for the parking light. One is for the turn signal function. Okay, two functions, one bulb. Get the new bulb, put it back in. Now if you're having trouble when you're going back in, don't worry. Just stop. Take the bulb out. Twist it around 180 degrees and then push it in. Now it's going to lock right in. That's the only position goes in. Now that's good. Let's put the bulb holder back in. And when you're doing so, if you see this gray part sticking out, right now it's not sitting flush. So wiggle it around, move it around a little bit, twist it. And now it's sitting flush like that. The gray part should not be sticking out like that. That is looking good. Now let's go ahead and twist it right. And now it's in its lock position. That was the passenger side. Now moving on to the driver's side. Exact same position. Same access port. Same everything. The bulb is right there. The black bulb holder. That's the one. I'm going to do it just to show it to you that it's exact same process and it's just as easy. The bulb is out. In order to get the bulb out, simply pull the bulb out. It's the exact same bulb as well. 3, 4, 5, 7, and A. That's the bulb replacement type number 3457NA. Get the bulb, put it back in, and then let's put the bulb holder back in and lock it. And I'm going to show you a different orientation of what it looks like if you were doing it from back there. You're going to twist it left like that. See, just twist it left, and then it comes out. When you put it back in, put it back in, and twist it right just a little bit to lock it in place. Now let's go inside the car, turn the hazard lights on, and see what it looks like now. And that is looking very good. We just changed the front turn signal bulbs on your Honda Odyssey. Hope you found it useful. In order to close the hood, push on the hood, get the prop rod out of the slot like that, put it back in its place, lower the hood, and then slam it shut.